Welcome. In front of me is a Samsung Galaxy Tab A, and today I'll show you how to wipe cache partition on this tablet. Now, before we get started, we will need a cable that you plug into for charging normally, but you want to connect it to your computer. Now, the computer can be either Mac or Windows, doesn't really matter. So, let's connect it to our device as well. And from here, power off your device. So you can pull down the notification, tap on the power key, and select power off. <laughs> now, once the device turns off, you want to hold the power key and the volume up, both of the keys at the same time. And for some reason, it's, I think, turning back on. Oh, no, wait. That was super weird. So in normal circumstances, you would need to hold power key and volume up, but apparently the device is so used to me saying it that it just decided to boot into it. Now that was sarcasm. Uh, I'm not sure what actually happened. But yeah, to boot into it, once the device is actually fully off, you hold power key and volume, uh, volume up. And when you see the Galaxy logo, you will let go of the power key while keep holding volume up, which will take you to here. Uh, like I said, I have no clue how it booted up without actually pressing anything, but I don't mind it. Uh, so, once you're in the recovery mode, you want to scroll down to wipe cache partition and then confirm it with power key. Again, let's select yes using volume keys and power key confirm that. And there we go, cache wipe complete. So, reboot system now is from there selected by default. So all you need to do is press Parky once more, and this will take us back to Android, which also we can unplug it. And as you can see, we are now back in Android. So, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.